M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So we're on the ICOM IC7100 and we're just going to show you how the linking system works once you're connect connected to a hotspot and possibly a repeater. So let's just come out of DR mode. Mike Zero, November Mike India. So there we are on HF. Mike Zero, November Mike India. Doing well? Uh, okay. Right, so we'll push DR and we're now in DR mode. The first thing we want to do is select what we're going to use. So in this case, we're using my hotspot, but I'll show you how to select a different thing. So tap the from section here, just tap it like that Then tap it again and you'll get repeater list. Now you could go select nearby repeater, but mine's not working because I'm probably haven't got a GPS position in there. Let's tap TX history. Okay, but forget that. For now, we're just going to go select something from our repeater list. So we'll go United Kingdom and let's go to a repeater. It'd be nice to find one near me. I think there's one near me in Cardiff. Oh, there's a Bristol one. I think Cardiff is probably the nearest one to me. Southwest UK, I am. Is it in there? No, maybe I might have to add it in. That's a shame, isn't it? Anyway, let's just choose the Bristol one, okay? And then if we want to use that repeater, we just tap link, tap again, and go your call sign, and then go all the way up, use repeater. Uh, if we were in range, we'd be able to go key up, M0FXB calling through, and we'd be calling through that repeater. But the only thing we're in range in is my hotspot, okay? So let's tap the bottom again, Go to the repeater list, which is in United Kingdom. Go to the top. So you will need to add your hotspot. I'll, I'll show you how to do that as well. So see the little slider here? It goes all the way there. So we want to get to the top. Like so, nice solid um, VFO on this. Hotspot, there I am there. So now I can use my hotspot. Now there's a few options we can do. We can just Use the hotspot now, but if we want, tap this, go to your call sign, and we can actually unlink. So let's go unlink now, because we are pretty sure we're linked to uh, Reflector 1 Charlie. So let's just unlink by keying. There's no one talking at the moment. So we'll just key up, and you've got the U come up here, look. Not linked. There you are, we're not, now we're not linked. Now if we tap again, we can go down to, tap the your call, go down to echo test, watch this. Mike Zero, Fox X3 Bravo, echo test. Now, no one can hear us, it's just going back and forth. No, it didn't work, so let's try it again. Mike Zero, Fox X3 Bravo, echo test. Now, maybe it's because we're not linked. Mike Zero, oh, there it is. Fox X3 Bravo, echo test. So that's what I sound like on air when I'm in digital. So, okay, let's try, tap again your call sign. We've got use repeater, we can try repeater status, that's an I, go like so, and then we'll key up. It should tell us we're not linked. Not linked. Right, so let's link to a, a reflector. So what we'll do is we'll tap the top half again, your call sign, and then keep going down. Now it doesn't work the same on all radios. So look, you've got loads here and you can actually create different links. But we're going to go link to one Charlie, which is a common one, or 30 Charlie, which is common. So we go to one Charlie, select it. It's not, we're now going to tell it to link. So just key the mic and it will link. Link to R-E-S. Zero, zero, one, Charlie. There you are. And now to talk, you have to tap it, your call sign, scroll back up and click use repeater. Now on other radios, it's use reflector. But on this one, it's use repeater. So now if I call through, people will hear me. Okay, so that's what gives you the basics of how to operate when you're connected to a hotspot or a repeater. Bye for now. 7-3, all the best.